Live. Um, so apparently Instagram favours this orientation. Uh, I mean, not Instagram, YouTube. So I'm going to go like this because um, apparently they favour this for live stuff. So we're live. It is what? Well, it's 11.58. It's just before 12 o'clock. Um, I have already sold. And annoyingly, it just started raining. Um, tell me if you can hear me. I think you should be able to. I am mic'd up. Um, let me see how this works. I've never been live on here before. Let's have a look. All messages are visible. Here we go. Close. So it should be. Oh, morning, nights. Um, yeah. So, whoops. Um, yeah, I've done 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 pizzas already, which means it's going to be a pretty good day. But it has just started raining a little bit. Hopefully, um, it's going to continue because it's been pretty pretty epic so far um so i'm just gonna what i'm gonna do is gonna leave you running there i'm gonna just smash out some pizza if i get a moment while i'm doing it here and i can look around and i can read a comment then i will um and we will we will see how we get on so hey what market do you work from i'm on st albans market um so what's the special today? Someone's just asked that. I'm running the one I call the Spanglish. Um, if you check my recent shorts, I uploaded that yesterday. It's, um, what is it? Uh, starts off life as a pizza margarita. I hit it with some little um, little sweet teardrop peppers, little fresh rosemary and some chorizo. It gets baked. Oh, and a little garlic oil as well. Comes out the oven and I finish it with some grated manchego. That's a solid pizza. It's absolutely epic. So, um, I'll tell you what I'm going to do, actually. I'm going to see if I can move you up. Tell me if this is a better angle. Do you want that angle or do you want where I was at? You tell me, because I, I need to know what's better for you guys. Move some stuff around. You tell me what's better. What's my uh, top? Thank you. What, uh, are you ever in London? Um, no, I mean, I'm in St. Albans. I'm only 20 minutes north of London, basically, uh, on a train. It takes no, it takes 25 minutes from like St. Pancras, and you can be in St. Albans. So uh, this is better. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to keep it at this angle then. As long as you can see what I'm doing, you can see a bit of the bake. Annoyingly, it's not, it's not quite wide enough, but it's fine. There's not much we can do about that. So. Um, yeah, uh, I'm, I don't do Saturdays. I used to do the Saturday market in St Albans, but I stopped um, mainly because I wanted to spend more time with my kids um, and I do a little bit more midweek stuff. So, hey, from Kentucky, so uh, angle is good. What tomatoes are you using at the moment? Uh, so I use a Palati tomato. Um, actually, these ones, I have a tin here. It's a Rega Palati tomato. Um, these are amazing, whole plum tomatoes. Uh, San Marzano, they're not worth the price. Um, as long as you've got a really good tomato and you're happy with it and it tastes good, then you don't need to, you don't need to buy San Marzano tomatoes. Um, there's not many, not many Neapolitan pizza restaurants we're using them anyway, so. Um, I've got a customer. Yes, sir. Can I get a margarita, please? Of course you can. Thank you. Let's go, uh, give it a tap, just below there. Just below the hatch. Lovely, you're in. About 70 seconds. No worries, thank you. Cool. Thank you very much. That's all right, you're welcome. It's a box or? 
we got? One's in the oven. See if I can get you a little bit. There you go. That might be better. There we go. You okay? Having a good day? Yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. I just wish the sun would have shined a bit longer. It was nice this morning. It was lovely this morning. It is only due to rain for a while, but yeah, unfortunately over right. lunchtime. Yeah. Like 12 till 12.30, which isn't ideal, but yeah, I know. it's cool. Yep. We're English. We're used to it. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah, true, true. Done. It goes. Beautiful. Thank you very much. Thanks, sir. Have some napkins. Thank you. We will need them. Yes, thank you very much. See you later. Bye bye. Bye. So recently, it's been. Um, it sort of dies off at about midday for a little bit, like roughly about 10 minutes or so. Um, occasionally, do tell me if you can't hear me at any point because um, I'm using a pretty rubbish mic setup. But um, yeah, basically it dies off a little bit and um, and then picks up like, and goes a bit mental for a while. So the good thing is it's given me an opportunity to sort of reset, get my boxes set up. I've got a massive stack of boxes today, um, ready for sort of pummel through the rush. But as it's, it's Easter holidays here in the UK, um, sort of this, this week mostly, kids, kids are off mostly this week, but some have already broken up. Um, there's a private school just around the corner and I often get a few of those guys come at about, about 10 quarter past one, but they've already probably broken up. Um, so I won't see them today. But I've had a few kids in town already getting pizza, um, which is good. So now we basically, we just wait. So let's have a look. Ah. Da -da -da -da. I see you stretch the pizza to be over the end of the peel. Do you find this helps with launch? Um, just making it bigger. It's a 30 centimeter peel. So, um, and I make like a 33 centimeter pizza. So I just stretch it a little bit over stretch it. Um, it's probably not ideal to do for a lot of people because you could catch, but I'm so used to it. So it just, I end up with a slightly overstretched one. Um, why don't you lie, especially for us? We could ask you your preparation and stuff. Um, yeah, man, I could, I could do, I could do that. Um, why don't you know especially for us we could ask you your preparation strategy some do's and don'ts yeah man i could I, i'm gonna get on to that so what i'll probably do um next week when i get a moment maybe maybe on my prep day on wednesday i mean on tuesday for the market i could i could go through some of that for you um like show you what i'm up to i am i am gonna shoot a dough making video show you exactly how i make my dough for business um and and like share some sort of pointers and stuff like that you know, there's no right or wrong in doing it in the, in the way anyone does anything. But um, yeah, if you just want to be a little bit more consistent, I could probably, I could hopefully, I could help with that to get a nice consistent dough. Um, Tom Stewart, do you prep in the kitchen or do you do this at home? So I have a prep kitchen at home. Um, a small prep kitchen that's kind of like my utility room. It's, it's a small space, it's all I need. All I need, I've got a 25 kilo dough mixer in there. Um, some refrigeration and it's kind of linked to my garage and I've got lots of like storage in there and stuff and I can pull my van straight up to my garage and go straight through so I keep everything out of the main part of the house um, there we go fairly new subscriber very cool business thank you I will keep it up point of sale system so I use a Zettel it's over here um, it's it's over there I can probably show you see that little thing there um, there's a card reader that's just below my hatch outside that is like a USB card reader that that's linked to the uh, Bluetooth linked to the iPad and the iPad runs Zettel software and it is like completely wireless. I just tap a button on the screen and then it comes up and they tap with their card. 
I do take cash if it's spot on. I just don't carry change because I don't really want to have to bother with that. Um, town's very dead at the minute. See what I mean? It's, it's quieting up around this time, but should get busy in a minute. Um, where are we? What's your normal hydration? So today I'm at 61.5, which is very exact. There you go, Samuel, 61%. So I, I, I stick below 63. I don't go crazy with the hydration. It all depends on the flour you're using and how far you can push it and the process you want and the final result you want. Um, but I make more of a classic Neapolitan pizza. So uh, how do you cook cool pizza in second seconds from some restaurant? Some restaurants do it longer. I mean, a uh, Neapolitan style pizza should be cooked in 60 to 90. That's why. Um, hold on a minute. I've got someone here. Boss. I'm live on YouTube. Just Good chatting. morning, YouTube. So you might be able to hear. This is Alec. The Good morning, chef. YouTube. Please don't swear. Um, <laughs> it's Al. I'm going to spin you around so you say hello. There's Al. There he goes. You might recognise him. He's a weeping chef. He does amazing barbecue food and stuff. Um, I'm just going to go and have a chat so you can listen. How's it going? You good? It's really good. It's just died. It, it was busy. I've done like... 26 pizzas okay, so far, which is, which is great. But every, I was just saying to everybody, this lot, like, um, that at like 12 o'clock, it just dies. It dies on its ass for about 10, 15 minutes and it Shame. seems to pick up again. But the rain is just, the town was well busy a little while ago. Yeah. And it's just sort of quietened off. So okay, well, let's get you it's busy all good. Then. It's all good. Do you want pizza? Yeah. What do you want? Jazz it up, Alex special. Yeah. Three pizzas. He wants the Joey special. <laughs> Let's go. What do you want? Pizza for the family? Cool. So this is this is traders' rights. So um, I went saw Alec yesterday. Had an amazing smash burger. And part of the deal about being another food trader is you sort each other out. Isn't that right, Al? Correct. There's no questions asked. What goes around comes around. I feed him, he feeds me. It's the way it goes. How was the fried so. pork yesterday? That was lovely actually. Yeah, really nice. Juicy, lovely. but crunchy at the same time. Beautiful, that's what you want. So what do you want, you usual? Do you want uh, one for the kids, one for the wife, one for you? Yeah, please mate. You book him up to your round. Yeah. No. Different delivery driver, so he does it delivers to me last instead of the other one who delivers to me first. Oh. So there's a four hour difference. That happens to me sometimes with suppliers. Yeah, if it's a new driver, I might get it a bit later than usual and it can sort of put you out a little bit with your prep. No. What do you want me to do? Something fantastic for you? Yeah, please mate. Always. It's always fantastic. So Alec here, he's not a fan of the cheese. It, it does funny things to his insides. So he'll get something without cheese. Um, I'm gonna do him a version of the Spanglish um, with extra meat on it. Same with his kids. For some reason they don't like cheese. They've got it from you, haven't they? Yeah, they're copying me. So they just have a little, little garlic oil, little oregano on the tomato. So an owl is gonna get uh, you're okay with milk, aren't you? Milk's fine. Yeah, cool. Well, milk is good. There's a, in the treat, so in the casing, apparently, there's a little milk okay. in there, so. And then one for his wife, she likes an Induya. So we're gonna hit her with that. Mm. 
Are you right with you, Jens? Hello, how are you? Hello, how are you? Not too bad, thank you. Excellent. I was saying you somehow appeared on my YouTube feed this week. Oh, did I? Yeah. Ah. Is that why you're here? Not really. Oh, okay, cool. Did you subscribe? I think I might have been already, that's how it's oh, I don't know. Nice. You jump on there, I'm live right now. You can see it oh, happening really? from a that's different angle if you want. <laughs> you mean yours now, you take home? Yeah, I had a little Piaggio up there, yeah. Uh, yeah, same, same, same spot. Used that for like three years. Good time, good time. What can I get you, sir? Pepperoni, sure. Two of them. No worries, pan together, yeah? Yeah. Lovely stuff. Can you give it a tap just below? Thank you very much. Nice. Right, in the box. Enjoy. I'll, uh, I'll call you later. I'll see you later, yeah? Have a lovely day. Thank you. Okay, let's go. Okay, two pepperonis. So guys, I'm just gonna leave you guys running for a while. Um, What's up, boss man? Hello, how are you? Oh, not too bad, how are you? Yeah, solid. Solid, making pizza. I'm in my happy space. I thought that was the gym or the coffee roast. You have too many hobbies, man. There can be multiple happy spaces. Ah. No, yeah. it's, not, it's not allowed. Basically, as long as I'm doing something for myself, I'm all good. I had enough time making money for other people. Back in the day. <laughs> yes. Gentle job. Yeah. <laughs> Although. You provide shareholder value. Do you? No. Nah, I think I do right now, but. You guys, you guys got great jobs. <laughs> What's new? What is new? Uh, I'm live on YouTube up here. To 169 people currently, I think something like that. 200 um, people are watching you make pizza live. They they are um, asking me questions which I can't answer because I'm not looking at the screen. <laughs> um, so sorry about that, guys. I'm mic'd up, so they can't really shouldn't really be able to hear much of what you guys are saying, which is probably a good thing. Um, <laughs> just just answer some of them like preemptive, like yes, no, maybe. Yeah. <laughs> just me waffling basically. I don't actually like pizza. What? <laughs> oh dear. Yeah, it's been a good day so far actually. I'm almost. I'm 29 pizzas down. Which is which is a good good uh, good amount for this this time of the day. I guess most of people are going to hit you up right now. If yeah, sort of from now on. Oh, hopefully. 
the reason it's been quite nice, I've, I've never felt too rushed. I've never had a mass, I haven't had a massive queue. Um, but there's always been customers there, which is really good. Yeah, it is better when you just got like a steady it's trickle nice. of people, yeah. right? It flows, when it flows. No pressure. I think it's also weather related a little bit. Yeah, it was lovely today, lovely this morning. Well, it's going to be raining in about five minutes. So if you hadn't noticed, we're, we're like English, we like to talk about the weather a lot. So, um... <laughs> Generally, it's like my chat to everyone is like, oh, it's all right. Cold, isn't it? Yep. A bit of rain. It's not cold in there, is it? No. <laughs> it's what, it's 30, not cold in It's 35, 30, 30, 30, 30, 30. That's not too bad. It's all right, actually. I've it's seen it worse. Yeah. Yeah. Guys, you want a slice, Jeff? Yeah, it's good. That smells good, too. Thank you very much indeed. Yeah, make sure you've got plenty of napkins. Yep. Thank you. Thank Fellas, you what can Thank I get you? you? Thank you very much. Uh, I want you? the Spanglish. Yep. So I'll pay for it myself. Wicked. And I'll get a Spanglish and a mug with two. Ah, uh, you're getting one. You're getting Jay's one. It's one of these orders that you say it out loud and you immediately know who's it for. I know who that's <laughs> Well, we'd also get some margarine chili. I don't know, I've never ordered for one of these, so... And chili honey, <laughs> if, you, if I ask nicely. You can have... Oh, you want, you want honey on the Spanglish? So? No, 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 no. You know what? Actually, I mm. first... I mean, yeah, it does have chili honey. It, no. Do you think, I mean, it, no, would, can, do you think it would work? I mean, it works with everything, man. Yeah, okay. I'll, I'll have some, please. A little bit of heat, sweet heat. Uh, so a regular customer asked for the Biscoff Bad Boy um, as it's his 60th birthday and um, he asked me, well the last week they kind of mentioned the fact that if I would consider doing it again and I thought yeah I'll do it for you if you want it so I'm going to recreate that one. Don't tell me you want one. I don't know who it is, so. <laughs> oh, good. It's custard, mm. baked custard, biscoff, oh, hot biscoff, icing sugar. Uh, Basically, it's yeah, a it's filthy good. sweet treat. I've, I've, I've managed to replicate relatively closely your uh, Nutella bad boy with the marshmallows. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. That is such a party hit. Oh, man. Every time you bring it, you, you know, you, you whip out like seven or eight pizzas for people, and you just save one. And then at the end, you just put that with the marshmallows. Everybody yeah, loves kids it. love that. I'll tell you what's a good version of that one is making it into like a calzone. Um, mm. But mixing mixing the uh, Nutella with some ricotta. Ooh, yeah, okay. Um, Cause, in, and that, that's a winner. So I, I've made a Nutella based pizza before and I just kind of- Did it burn? No, it worked okay, actually. Um, in a normal oven with a oh, pizza okay, stone. Yeah. And I put Nutella, uh, some sugar, <laughs> just because it wasn't sweet enough. And then, and <laughs> yeah, some a little cookies. extra sugar. Okay, cool. <laughs> and yeah. like crumbled cookies. Did not ex like the Nutella look like it's quite solid. I did not expect it to be basically blisteringly hot. The oh inside. man, yeah, it's like lava that stuff, man. It you was go. crazy. Last time I was doing the the, the Nutella and marshmallows, like, the marshmallows actually caught fire. Oh uh, yeah, so they got to go back they, in the oven right ignited, at the end because I held right it too close to the flame. Right at the end. <laughs> That was exciting. Still edible, still nice. Nicely charred. Yeah. Edible. Thank you. Thank you. I've seen you uh, praising the new Gosney peel. May the, oh, the, the pro peel. Yeah, it's incredible. Hmm. So um, I actually. Are you being influenced? Uh, yes, I am. Yeah. You could be influenced. <laughs> so, so, so this one here is actually a first edition of it. Okay. So I helped develop a little bit of development on that pill. That's probably why um, it's good. <laughs> so, yeah, I would say it's extremely good. It's a good mix. It's a, it's a mix, a really good mix of like a, um, a round pill and a square pill because mm. it's kind of got, it's kind of square and then it's got a rounded sort of frat, uh, face to it. Um, so you can be you can be more direct and get the pizzas like into the corner. 
like because the way the dome and the uh, the new and the arc and the and the rock box they're sort of curved at the rear. Uh, so you, so you have let, to chuck them in a specific. Yeah. So if you've got a square pizza, a square peel, trying to get like into the corner of an oven, mm, there's a pain. Yeah. You can't. You can't. So I can go right deep into that that back edge yeah, yeah, yeah. with these. So um, yeah, it's a great peel. Super lightweight. Really comfortable. So I've got I've got the Gosley turning pill here, the balance pill. Uh -huh. But I love it. But um, I'm so used to this one. I've been the, using, the, the I've been, one, mate, right? I've been using this pill for like seven years. This it's exact, exact one. Exact same pill. <laughs> it's like it feels like an extension of my arm. Yeah. That one does. It feels it's an amazing pill. It's just You're I, just so used to this one, I guess. I've, this got, I've got to commit to using it because I love it. Actually, the head on that one's better because it doesn't have rivets. It doesn't like the uh, little so it rivets. Doesn't catch on. Yeah, they can be an issue. Um, it's just a, you know, yeah. just jumping in, getting in it. So there you go. That's why I'm not using that one. It's just making me want to get my parents a golf thing for, for the home. But oh, you haven't got, 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 got a garden, garden though. They have a garden, so. And you don't? I don't, no. Still need to enjoy the over. Yeah, you do. I really do. Oh, I'm coming over for pizza. At some point, I will just bring myself over. And just, just rock up at my door. Right? Why don't you, yeah, why don't you just, be, I'm just messing to be honest, and, like, To be honest, it. when I'm on fraternity leave, you might as well. I don't have anything else to do. <laughs> Maybe not, because I haven't actually. I don't know. Oh, 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 yeah. That's fine, it's fine. Oh, I've got a seat in there. I've done it now, it's too late. Go live with it. Another box. Are you paying for. I'm paying for the mug and the spine. Thank you. Alright, good. Tap. Yes, sir. Uh, of course you can. Uh, so I'm not going to be back at Victoria Square this month, I think. Okay. Um, yeah. Oh, no, no, I, I will. Uh, yeah, no, not this month, but not uh, towards the end. I think I'm doing the 16th. 16th of April? Yeah, because during it's the... Fine. I'm basically away from those It's holidays, people. and a lot of you guys are, uh, I guess, away anyway. So. Yeah, I'll be in Japan. Nice. That's fine, I'll eat your pizza. <laughs> I'll send you a photo. I'm sure you sent me some. <laughs> that's, that's what happened when I was in Japan. He sent me the pizza. I just started sending all the stuff yeah, I was having. The again. Japanese pizza game is pretty damn good. Right? I haven't actually had any Japanese pizza pizza. Yeah, there's, um, uh, there's some amazing pizza there. Uh, Those are like artists. For the like about whatever they do, they really just commit to it and it really does show. Oh, beautiful. Right. Cool. Do you want you taking these, yeah? Yep. yep. Okay. Thank you, sir. Cheers. Thank Thank you, guys. See you later. See you Bye-bye. Sorry guys, I can't really uh, look up and look at the comments. Hopefully I'll be able to go through them later. Um, I'm just, I'm just going to leave you guys there. If you're interested, stay around.
ones that Right, I'm going to go because I uh, seem to have lost the microphone. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed that. I'll be back later. Bye.